the given function g models the value of an investment t years after it's made. Easiest way to think about this is when t is equal to 1, our 52,000 is going to increase by 6%. Which of the following functions best models the value of the investment m months after it's made? So again, when t is 1, our m should be equal to 12, and both of these should increase our 52,000 by 6%. So looking down below, when I plug in 12 for this m, I get 12 divided by 12, which is 1. This increases by 6%, so this is right so far. In B, I get 12 times 12, which is 1.06 raised to the 144. We want it to be raised to the 1 to match this equation up above. In C, when I do 12 divided by 12, I get 1, but it's times 1.0612, which is a little bit different than 6%. And finally, in D, when I plug in 12, I get you know 1 for my exponent, also increasing by 6%. So this is a rare one. We're going to just have to test maybe another easy number, like when t is equal to 2. Uh, we're going to get 1.06 squared, which should be when m is equal to 24. So in a, when I plug in 24, this actually becomes 1 half, whereas when I plug in 24 over here, we do get raised to the 2, like our original function is. So it looks like finally d is going to be our right answer.